Hello, this is part 4. Here I will show you how I am releasing updates for, for the application. So, on the GitHub, you can do it uh, in whatever way you want. I have an HTML page, you can see it right here, XR Free Player update page.html. And every time I release a new update, I release a new version of the application, I'm adding a new article and each article has an ID as you can see here you see it has an ID so you can see that the latest update of the application is 69 yes and let's go on the code so when I'm building my jar file the application it has a version and as you can see currently now it has version 68 so every time the application starts i'm using a library called gsoup let's see it here um it is somewhere here gsoup yes here it is which is reading the html page you can see here the url here it is the URL of the HTML page. It is reading it and if the latest article ID, which is 69 now, is bigger than the version of the application, which is just a variable, then we have a new update. So go and download it. And we have seen how it's done on the previous uh, on the previous parts of this tutorial so i'm using gsoup if the latest article id is bigger than the version go and uh, download it so i will make and the part uh, five which will be a summary of all of them that we talked in these tutorials